in an earlier video, I spoke about how caffeine affects neurodivergent brains and why it is not as simple as, oh, caffeine is a stimulant. The short version is caffeine works differently in autistic and ADHD brains. And if you're autistic, caffeine might give you a short burst of energy or just nothing at all. Or if you have ADHD, it might help you focus or even calm you down enough to fall asleep. So if you're both autistic and ADHD, the effect can be something completely different again. Here's the kicker. The way caffeine affects you can change from day to day and even hour to hour. Now that got me asking, why? This hasn't been studied. So I started to dig into biology and I came up with a hypothesis and I think it comes down to neuroimmunity and neuroinflammation. Neuroimmunity is the brain's broader immune network and it links what happens in the brain's immune system to the rest of the body, your arms, legs, metabolism, and even your gut through the gut-brain axis. It also shapes on how neurons adapt and change throughout our lives. Inside our brain are microglia and astrocytes, uh, which are security guards. When we are stressed, these immune competent cells will activate and they start to release cytokines, chemokines, reactive oxygen species, and all of them work together and it, tr it triggers immune responses. This is important for defense, but it is also how chronic inflammation and autoimmune problems start for us. So in your divergent brains, research shows that these security guards, microglia and astrocytes, are often already on high alert. And th there's persistent microglial activation in specific brain regions, altered inflammatory signaling, and mitochondrial stress, meaning that the brain's immune system has been reset to a different baseline. Now comes in caffeine into the system. Caffeine is supposed to block adenosine receptors and turn on the chill switch. On immune cells, this changes inflammation signals. On neurons, it changes how dopamine and glutamate are released. But the outcome depends entirely on baseline immune